Hello everybody. Happy Disney Monday. Oh my gosh, I finally get to participate with Jude. <laughs> um, this cute little outfit that he is wearing, Shelly gave this to me and Caleb got to wear it, but Jude hasn't yet. So as you can see, it has Pooh and it has Tigger and they're all ready to play baseball. And it says, 100 acre baseball champs it's just so so cute and then the little shorts say Pooh and tigger with a little baseball here it's just a really nice comfy little outfit very much like the one that i put zoe in just really really comfy and then these little socks you guys oh my gosh shelly gave these to me in a different package from the outfit but look it matches perfectly it has the red and the blue and it has the little laces so it literally looks like little shoes and I thought it matched the outfit really nice and since it's a nice cozy kind of a Monday um, I don't think he needs shoes since this has that kind of look to it <clears throat> it's so sweet on him Oh, you're just so cute. So it's been a very, very busy day. Um, I had all three of my nieces today. My mom came over with the girls and we had like um, a fun day out in the playing with the water. And um, yeah, we just had a really, really good time. The reason why I had my other two nieces over is because there are some things going on with their daycare center. Um, their daycare center is actually under investigation. One of the teachers was caught shoving one of the little three-year-olds off the chair, pushed them off their little chair and was yelling at them. It was all caught on tape. I don't know who filmed it, who recorded it, but thank God that they were caught. That person was fired. Now um, the authorities are getting involved because there has been several um, complaints about this particular daycare center. Um, so my brother has pulled them from the daycare center and now him and his ex are trying to find a new daycare facility. So um, I, it looks like I'll be watching the girls three days out of the week <clears throat> until that gets resolved. Um, I would love to watch them full time, but it's not my decision. It's my brother's ex. And since they have to come to a mutual agreement about who watches the kids um, and with her work schedule, it's easier for her to have the daycare center watch them. Believe me, I rather watch them myself, um, especially finding out that that had happened. So... Anyway, to rewind, we had a really good day playing out there in the water. The girls had a great time. Um, and I thought, well, now that they have left, they've gone home, I wanted to come in and make a short video with you guys and show you how cute Jude looks in his little, little Disney outfit. I wanted to show you that little hat that I was talking about when I, was, I had him in the carrier. This is the hat I bought at Babies R Us. And it's a little bucket hat. I want to attach a chin strap somehow. I'm gonna have to look up a tutorial on how to do that because I wouldn't have bought it, but I just loved it for the 4th of July with all of the stars and then the stripe on the outside. And then he could wear it, um, not just on Memorial Day or the 4th of July, he could wear it anytime just because of how the hat looks on the outside. He could even wear it with this outfit. So let me just show you guys. This is a um, koala baby zero to three months. And as you can see, it's, it's, it's pretty big. Well, I mean, it's big, but it, it still looks cute. But I think if I had the little chin strap, it would hold the hat on just a little bit better. Um, especially for a baby that has painted hair. Uh, is kind of slick, you know, it, it doesn't hold the hats on very well. So, um, look how this looks. <laughs> Isn't he cute? I just love 
when I flipped it up like this, I go, oh my gosh, this is so freaking cute. I couldn't, I couldn't leave it there. And it was the last zero to three months, uh, in this hat. So, um, now I did see Annie's video and she had incorporated elastic in the back of her beanies. So you'll have to let me know, Annie, if that could be done with this particular style of hat. Um, cause I know it worked on the beanie that you made or that you altered. So let me know if you could send me a message or write in the comments if that would work or if I should attach the little, the little, um, strings on the side, uh, to hold the hat on. Cause I don't, I, like I said, I just don't want to lose it. I don't want it to fall off his head and, you know, land on the floor and get dirty, <clears throat> especially when I have them in the carrier. So yeah, I just thought I would run that by or anybody else out there who does a lot of sewing. If you could give me a tip, um, that would help, but it's super cute hat. I just love the stars and the little simple stripes. So yeah, so I wanted to share that with you guys. Also, I received two packages in the mail. So, um, I'll open that on the next video. I want to go ahead and put this one up for, um, Disney Monday, get that loaded because it's getting later. So, um, yeah. So I hope everyone had a wonderful Monday. Kisses to all his aunties. Mwah. And, uh, see you in the next video. Ta-ta.